what does it mean to go out on a senior night and turn up 317 yards and six touchdowns on the ground as an offensive lineman? It was fun. It was just, I think it was just, we all were just having a great time out there. That was something Coach Pugh said before the game. He just looked around and just the weather, the settings, like this is a night to run the football. So we felt like we had a good week of preparation and we're excited to be able to go out and run the ball against them. So it was great. We had a, we had a fun night on the line. Bush talked about the defense performance because give up the early touchdown and then pretty much shut them down the rest of the game. Yeah, that, uh, I mean, going into our game, we were expecting to start fast, but things happened where we kind of freaked out a little bit. And once we got it together, they weren't going to score again. And so uh, you've seen that this defense is, is a very strong minded defense where when we come out to play, Boise can't put up very many points against us. He can't put very, very many points against us. And so we're excited to move on from this game and and on a win with, on senior night and then go out and play Utah next week. Austin, why do you guys always start slow? Um, that's a great question. <laughs> that's the one I've been thinking about towards the end of the game. I think just, I think what something we could really work on is just being really excited going out on that first drive. Sometimes I think it's, we feel a little bit flat. So I think just trusting our assignments, really trusting our teammates and going out and just playing it with a high level of energy will really help with that. Butch, what were the emotions kind of like tonight on senior night and all of that hoopla and then also the added bit of wanting to get this win to try to become bowl eligible? Uh, for me, at least senior night didn't really hit me until we, we walked as a senior class from the 50-yard line to the end zone. Um, going into the week, all the seniors have said, this, it's, we have another game on our, on our hands, so we got to win so we can get to the bowl game. And so it wasn't until we took that walk that I finally was able to just sit back and relax and enjoy um, my time because I've been really grateful and really fortunate to be here. So. Is it good knowing that you can go into that game next week with those six wins? Yeah, That's it's good. Yeah. It's good to know that they're winning as well. And so the, the opportunity to come out and play at their place and play at a high level is exciting for us and we're excited for the challenge. I was thinking a similar question to what Sean just asked. What were your feelings on senior night? Uh, yeah, it really didn't hit me till uh, earlier. T earlier today, we had a meeting as the offense where everyone just stood up and one by one they went through the seniors and everyone was able to just share some of the feelings that they had for them and just lessons they've learned from them. And that's when it hit me, just that this is my last game at home, and it really just excited me. I was excited getting on the bus, excited getting here, getting dressed, and. I was able to have a, a great night, I felt. So it was a special experience to be able to play here senior night. Which is there almost a sense of redemption knowing that you guys missing a bowl a year ago have gotten back to being bowl eligible this year? Um, in, in a way, just because that's one of our goals is to be bowl eligible. But um, we, we feel like we shouldn't be in the position that we're in. And we're kind of upset that we kind of let some games slip away. but. You know, the opportunity to play again and be one of the last few teams to win a game is exciting. And so we're excited for Utah, and then we're excited for that bowl opportunity to play whoever in the country we're aligned to play against. So. I asked the young guys this, but just for you as well, just the fact that, you know, guys were able to control the game, and so just about everybody was getting in. You know, the, the seniors that are playing that were dressed were able to get in the game. What does that mean to, to, for all the guys to be able to, to get out there and get on that field one it, it more means time a, It means a lot. Um, in, in my last defensive series, uh, I was supposed to go in, but I mean, one of the guys that's one of the hardest workers on the team is Nate Sampson. And I, I kind of just talked with the coach and I'm like, well, you got to put this guy in. It's his senior year too. It's not just mine. And so Nate had the opportunity and when he came off, he was like, Butch, I'll remember this forever. And so just talking with a lot of the boys, the, the, the opportunity to play here at Lavelle Edwards Stadium is, is one that's not given to very many. And so... Each of us had the opportunity to cherish that moment tonight and play on that field. So, what's your favorite memory playing here for, for both of you? Uh, mine hasn't changed. Uh, when people asked me this early in the season, my favorite memory was when my brother scored his first touchdown last year. Um, as an older brother, you expect to play or you hope to play with your younger brother and see success. And when he had that in his first game as a freshman, I was really excited and got to share with him that moment just by jumping fist bumping and chest bumping him right after. So that's my favorite moment. I think tonight will for sure be the top moment for me, just being able to play senior night. Uh, one from the past is 
uh, when we beat Boise State on the Hail Mary a couple of years ago. <laughs> that was that was a fun one. But you got to run out with Neil, didn't you, for the pregame yeah. intros? What what went into that? Not something you see very often, but no. Um, I mean, thankfully, Coach Kalani, uh, right before we all went out as seniors, he said, "Brothers, you guys are more than welcome to." And so. Right when he said that, my brother looked at me and I looked at him and I was like, dude, you're coming with me. He was like, it's going to be cold. And I was like, all right, that's fine. But sacrifice just a couple minutes for me, please. And so he stayed out there with me and we got to run together. So it was a special moment. It wasn't that bad tonight. You guys have played a lot colder games than this. We have.